This is a dolly that I built using construction grade plywood. It'll hold the vacuum cleaner and the cyclone. I was able to reuse the wheels off of the vacuum cleaner. Put a pull cord on it so it's easier to move it around. that. We're going to show you here in a minute how to make a better connection for this hose. Sharpen it up a little bit to keep it out of the way. Vacuum cleaner hose, cut it in half. Go to the hardware store. This is an inch and a half coupling. Inch and a half by one inch reducer. Those will get glued like so. Take a piece of one inch pipe. This is three inches long taper about half of it so that that will fit inside the vacuum cleaner hose and you just get it on there as best you can like so and we're going to take black electric tape we're going to wrap that to make it tight and that will get glued into the reducer and there's the assembly. Push that down on top of our collector. Plug that into the shop vac. That hose will stay out of our way. Some people may want to consider putting a 90 degree elbow on here and making this even shorter. I recommend against that. You want to keep these radiuses as big as possible. This is tight enough. We start getting this at a tighter 90 degree, uh, we're going to start cutting down on airflow. So this works out pretty well. Just leave it like that. I've got a dust collector system hooked up to my major pieces of equipment and I have a floor sweep. So this shop vac's not used for anything other than sanding usually. Uh, this is a ported cable hose attached to a, a sander and I'm going to have to adapt from this inch and a half to inch and a quarter and then I can put that on here and tape this ported cable hose on here and I'll have an easy connection to uh, make and break. When I make stuff in the shop I try to make it so it's easy to attach and remove. Uh, easy to change hoses from one application to another. If you have to fight with it, chances are you're not going to bother. You're just going to let the dust fly because it takes too long to use it. So take that extra step. Make it, make it easy to, uh, to take it off. Make it easy to empty the bucket. Make it easy to connect your hoses. And if you put a pull cord on it, it's easy to get this thing to follow you around the shop.